So, Mama, want to check out those skeletons now? I said, to the death. Uh, uh, no, I should have gone for the throat. <laughs> Still, that was pretty intense, you little goblin. Oh, did you hear that? A secret must be so embarrassing. Then it can only be one thing, bro. A secret crush? And it's probably you. Uh -uh, no doubt. That's what she was writing in that diary. <clears throat> Dear diary. Beast Boy is so handsome. I want to kiss his pretty face. <laughs> <laughs> I can't wait to read the juicy details. Hmm. The words are moving. Oh. <laughs> oh. You're holding it upside down, dummy. Thirteen seconds. That's as long as you were ever in a good mood, Mama. <laughs> that was a record. <laughs> Beast Boy! Shh. <laughs> hey, guys! You are not gonna believe what Cyborg just did! <laughs> Can it wait? I was about to permanently banish Beast Boy into another dimension. Yeah, 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 you can banish him later. Check it out. I created a computer program that analyzes all of your personality traits and matches them with your ideal superhero mate. She's an awful person. No, there's a good side to her, Rave. I know it. I'm just not good enough for her. You know, there's another girl out there who I bet likes you. If she's out there, why hasn't she told me? My turn! Raven? 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 Uh, me? No, that must be a mistake. Hey, computers never lie. Wow, this changes everything. You can't actually be taking this seriously. I'm willing to give it to give us a shot. If you are. Now! Yo, girl, have you been using the power of telepathy again? I don't have the power of telepathy. Because you've been on my mind all day. Why aren't you wearing sunglasses indoors? I have to wear them because our future is so bright together, Mama. Lady Legasis, you came back! I had to. Apparently, no one else can handle the dark power of my cloak. And so, for the greater good of humanity, I'll resign to bear the burden of wearing it again. No! The legs! The legs are gone! <laughs> Whatever. <laughs> And how are things progressing with the lady friend? It's getting pretty serious. She wants to know everything about me. Oh, my hopes and my dreams, my passcodes and security clearances, all yours too. Oh, boy. Oh, the boy indeed. Now, do you guys see what I'm talking about? Look, there's something you should know about your girl. What? What is it? I think she's in the L word with you. Lobster. Love. Oh, that is an even better L word. I am filled uh, with the happiness for you. Uh, really? You think so? Why else would she be spending so much time picking your brain about everything concerning you and the Titans? Sounds like she's using him to collect intel on us. Do you know what else it sounds like? <laughs> that somebody's J E L S. <laughs> <laughs> That's sweet, Raven. But I've found my match. Still friends? I hate you all. 
Oh, man. You have got it so bad for Beastie, don't you? Well, I'm late for a date in the Titan's secret lair with my boo. Azeroth Metrion. Synthos! I can't believe I'm stuck here again! Ah! Well, at least we're stuck in here together, Mama. Oh, snap! Vegetarian chili! <laughs> Beast Boy, I didn't get to tell you how I feel. Azeroth Metrion Xanthos! <laughs> Great job getting that working again, Cyborg. Uh... I have an exciting announcement, Titans. We will be funding a new community improvement project. We should totally build a community pool. I am a great doggy paddler. And you know what pools mean? Pool parties. A uh, pool is nice, but we really need to help out an underserved population. Offspring of interdimensional demons. Half robots? Bilfers? We're building a new senior citizen center. A senior, a senior citizen, citizen center. center. Uh, you sure you don't want to reconsider the pool idea? It's already settled. We're helping the seniors. Is not the wave of heat glorious? I have purchased an Earth Bikini on the line. Now I just need a place to use it. We're building a pool! <gasps> Joy! Oh, we must commence with the plans. So, Ray Ray, you gonna buy a new bathing suit too? This is my bathing suit. Hi. You are a raven, and I a dove. And even though we are different, we are meant to be in love. Oh, come on! That took me, like, all day to come up with. And it'll take me all day to forget. How about a little romantic horsey back ride? <laughs> yeah! What's got you all worked up? I'm not worked up. Oh, well, sorry. It's hard to tell how you really feel with your delivery sometimes. But you should really stop passing that thing around like a ball. You need to calm down! You are out of control! Oh, yeah, you're not mad. You are at least excited about the butt-kicking of the Dr. Light, yes? Woo. Was that excitement or your trademark use of the sarcasm? Uh, guys, I think this thing just turned on. Or something. You take it! I don't want it. Uh-uh! Whee! I love this game! Uh-oh. <gasps> <gasps> oh, no! <laughs> we just split Raven into four versions of herself! Actually, there are five ravens now. At least one of us can get out of her tower. There was a princess named Rapunzel who was trapped in a tower. All the princes of the land wanted to rescue her. Hey, yo, Rapunzel! Let me get up in that tower, girl! The tower had no stairs, but luckily Rapunzel was gifted with long, healthy, and very curly fingernails. No! No! Uh, come on, prince. Are you gonna rescue me or not? Uh, nah, I'm good, yo. It's the nails, isn't it? Can't you just cut them? And what would you use to climb up and rescue me? Ugh, they're just so gnarly. You princes are worthless. Forget this. If I'm going to escape, I'll just do it myself. Lady, I would ask for your hand in marriage. Also, I have brought you this nail file. No one's gonna cage this bird again. 
And so Rapunzel went on to live an awesome life of adventure and intrigue, using her rad fingernails to slice and dice her way to fame and fortune. You okay, Raven? I told you not to mess around with that thing. Ow! Free! Free! I'm free! I don't like it here. What's not to like? Mm -hmm. uh. Go away. Raven, it takes two to make a relationship work. We don't have a relationship. Give it up. I have never given up on anything in my life. And I am not giving up on us. What are you talking about? You give up all the time. I give up. If you can give me one reason we're not meant to be together, I'll walk away right now. Hmm, well, you're rude, you smell, you're annoying, you say bro and do too much, I hate the color green, your voice irritates me, tofu makes me sick, you're irresponsible, all you do is play video games, you can't die a tie, you're messy, you chew with your mouth open, your face gives me the creeps, your jokes are dumb, your pranks are stupid, your dancing embarrasses me, you're lazy, you're dumber than the animals you turn into, your clothes are always covered in pizza stains. Wow, no one's ever known me like you do. <laughs> I knew it! <laughs> Let me go! You know how I had my suspicions about Tara? Well, I spied on her and found out she's been collecting info to take us out. <gasps> I cannot believe it! Do you know what this means, Raven? <gasps> that you are completely not so! We never realized you are so in the love with Beast Boy. I am so sorry, Tara, but I guess jealousy just makes people do crazy things. I am not jealous! Uh, look, you'll believe me when I show you the evidence. Titan Cat! Ah! Ravens, go! Now will you admit that Tara was using Beast Boy to take us down? Wow. You guys said she was crazy about Beast Boy, but you didn't tell me she was cuckoo, cuckoo. The villain world is gonna pay a lot for what I've uncovered here. Peace out, Titans. Tara? What's going on? Uh, um... You're leaving without telling me, aren't you? <sighs> Sorry, uh, things are just getting too intense between us. Beast Boy, wait! Just wanna tell you. Go get her, tiger. Don't leave Tara! You can't tell me you don't feel anything for me. You want to know how I really feel? Fine. What did you do to her, Raven? Banished her to another dimension. You're welcome. But she was just about to tell me how she felt. Looks like somebody's a little jealous. Well, guys, looks like Raven was right. Thank you. Guess it was kind of silly to think you were in love with Beast Boy. And why is that so silly? Because you lack redeeming qualities. <laughs> we're sorry. You should be. But just the thought of Beast Boy and me looks too scary to me. I'll go if you come with. I'm good with whatever. Let's get out of here! her to another dimension. You're welcome. Let me out of here! You can't do this to me! Ah! Hmm. He will
will not leave you alone, will he? No, ever since Cyborg's computer matched us. He's convinced we're meant to be together. And you are not? Of course not. I want someone who thinks and acts like me. Hey, Raven. Hey, Starfire. Look, I know what you're doing, and it's not gonna work. Oh, come on! Just give me a chance, please. Pretty please with scary things on top. Look, I painted my fingernails black for you, Raven. No, let me make myself clear. I want nothing to do with you, ever. I think I want to make this thing work. You mean it? <laughs> Raven. <laughs> but will you marry me? This is beautiful. I guess Beast Boy and I were meant to be together. I've never been so happy. Whoa, whoa, whoa! Hold the bacon! There was a tiny, teensy, teensy, weensy little glitch in my matchmaking program. You mean I might not be Beast Boy's ideal match? Only one way to find out. Looks like Beast Boy's ideal match is... The scratching post. A scratching post. Hey, computers never lie. How could I have been so blind? What was that? Uh, a squeaky hinge, probably? What is that noise? I don't know, man. It's getting weird in here. It was I. Oh, Robin, you have learned the whistle. Indeed, Starfire. That's not whistling, brah. Sure it is. As I've done with all of my shortcomings, I've adopted the use of a gadget. Change the subject, quick. Good idea. How about I make breakfast? What do you guys feel like? Waffles. Waffles. Of course you do. Right. Here you go. Waffles. Waffles, waffles, waffles. Waffles, waffles? <laughs> waffles, waffles. Is that not what you asked for? Waffles. Ah, it's going to be a long day. <sighs> waffles. <laughs> the Valentines, then. Already got a secret Valentine. <laughs> Someday, baby. Someday. Well, I guess that leaves me and you, Mama. What about it? Bleh. Well, that wasn't a no. Azerath Metrion Zinthos. There. Now you can watch another video. <laughs> <laughs>